Welcome on Kane's Jurassic Year. Today we're back to Avatar, the quest for balance. At this point, there is no turning back. As the battle raged, Sokka, Suki, and Toph did their part to sabotage the Fire Nation airships. Meanwhile, Zuko and Katara went to confront Azula, who they found had become unhinged. To settle their conflict once and for all, Zuko invoked an Agni Kai, and Azula agreed. Sorry, but you're not going to become Fire Lord today. I am. You're hilarious. But fine, let's settle this. Just you and me, brother. The showdown that was always meant to be. Agni Kai! Alright, she definitely has like a very cool, like crazy sort of vibe going to her. I like how she says we're doing it alone and then just comes over here and <laughs> starts attacking him. Uh, we need to. Hey! <laughs> You'll never be Fire Lord Azula. You slow. Oh, come on, that should hit her. Is it water? Disappear. Whoa. You're crazy, Azula. She has lightning powers too? Have to win. I lived my whole life to get here! Alright, hold on. So we know we're gonna to need to hear my concern. <laughs> what? You're still here? This is the last time you'll cross me! Okay, so this she's just sort of You're gonna be going waiting up top. I will become the You will get to be Alright, wait for it. Did that actually start a release? Really nice? <laughs> so, you know, this is why I don't regret upgrading, like, Katara and, you know, like, actually spreading out her points to everybody. Because it seems like each person sort of has their own role to play. Katara definitely seems to be more on the stronger side. Do something about that. I will become the Fire Lord! I will! Zuko, on the other hand, We're gonna stop you he right might have been a lot more right useful now. if we had spent more upgrade tokens on him. I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. Although he's definitely no master. You've lost, Azula. Give it up. Maybe like some of the other people we have. Hero and Boomy? They're definitely way stronger than everybody else. Uh, let's see here. So we need to get you over there. You'll never be Fire Lord Azula. Can't be. We did it. Despite all she's done, I feel sorry for Azula. Together, Zuko and Katara defeated Azula. It was now all up to Aang, who had to confront Fire Lord Ozai, stop him, and end the war. After all the failed attempts to find you, now the universe delivers you to me as an act of providence. We don't have to fight. You have the power to stop what you're doing. You are right. I do have the power. I have all the power in the world! Alright, so... 
So we're definitely going to have to be dodging fire trails. Now, how are we supposed to stagger him? I refuse to kill you! Stay still already! Okay, so whenever he starts bragging, the back of the face of wind. Part of the plan. Uh, nice. I ah. will break the cycle of the avatars. Ah. Oh, that was super Once and for all. You'll never win. I refuse to kill you. So it's gonna come over here to us. Ow! I will stop you! Hey! So there's boulder on the right side. I'm going to assume that our job is just to smack him in the face as much as possible here. I will break the cycle of the avatars. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Uh, I am breaking the cycle. Always another way. You'll never win. Okay. So, so now all we have is one more on the left side here. He is going like completely crazy. So we're going to have to wait for him to do his lightning abilities, and then we're going to have to basically send it back to him. Okay, so it's telling us to do the wrong button, so whenever it says deflect, that's basically your block button. Now I'm starting to understand this fight. So he's going to blow up his fire. The deflecting is going to be glitched on the screen, but that's fine. So you'll see that it sort of turns into lightning. That's when you know to get your block up. To kill you. Is he stunt? Wasted that one. Oh, we missed it. I will turn your hopes into ash. You can't save the world. Here we go. Now this fight's starting to make sense. So this round was definitely the hardest one. It sort of took a little bit of figuring out how to actually deflect it properly. Once you get that figured out, though, it's not too bad. Uh. I will uh. turn your hopes. Uh. No, you can't take my power. You can't. So 
the game just sort of picks and chooses whatever move it wants to do for you out of the four different elements. Blocking is going to cause a tornado to spawn on him, though. Looks like we do not have a health bar, so this fan, basically, we can just take all the damage and do everything super cool. Take my power! You can't! No, I'm not going to end it like this. Even with all the power in the world, you are still weak. energy your own spirit must be unbendable or you will be corrupted and destroyed To me. I took away your firebending. You can't use it to hurt or threaten anyone else ever again. Nice! Spirit Trials now unlocked. And we get a safe fire bending scroll. Like it'll be size and damage of fire ring is increased. Soon after, Zuko became the Fire Lord, ending 100 years of war. And Aang had truly become the Avatar. Balance was restored. That won't do at all. Even as happy endings go, that was a bit uh, predictable. But that is how these events came to a close. Perhaps, but that's not how my play will end. I need to send the audience out the door chattering madly, wildly conjecturing, imagining. Peace is what many in your audience have only imagined their entire lives. Now they have it. Is that not enough? That's my point. They already have that, but I must give them something new. Fresh, a cliffhanger, a, a twist, <gasps> twist upon twist. Like? For example, Appa and Momo will speak, if only to each other. Audience love talking animals, and Aang, he's taken the Fire Lord's power, but perhaps, just perhaps, he also inherits the Fire Lord's long, lustrous hair. For all the power of the Avatar, he just can't do anything with his hair! Oh! And as for the new Fire Lord, with all due respect to your nephew, the real eye-opener would be to make Katara the new Fire Lord! Oh, that'd get the crowd, and a few critics I know, really talking! Why, I can see it now. The Ba Sing Se players would be acclaimed throughout the land! But were you not striving for more historical accuracy? Oh, you dear man. How about I leave you to making your delicious tea, and you let me handle the theater? Now I really must dash off. I have what you might call a little bit of drama bending to do. <laughs> Thank you so much for regaling me with your thrilling tales. Fear not, gentlemen. I will do you and the Avatar. Proud. Ta -da! I somehow doubt that production will do anyone proud. On the positive side, I believe she has revealed to me an 86th Jing. 
I'd rather drink poisonous tea from the white jade bush than go through that again. Ha! <sighs> <sighs> the tea's gone cold. Allow me to make a fresh pot. Thanks so much for all the support on this series. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you like and subscribe. Let me know if there's more games like this that you want to see covered on the channel. It was definitely a fun one. If they ever do make a second iteration, I'll definitely be checking it out. This sort of had like a very nostalgic old school vibe to it, but it still was really nice, detailed game. I had super fun time with the puzzles and leave a comment down below if you guys want to see what the spirit trials are. We might still have a few videos on this game left to do. Not entirely sure what that entails yet.